Oh my god, guys. You guys gotta see what I picked up today. I just picked up on this way to this birthday party. We were a little early. I paid 50 cents per game on these. Blitz 2000. And I'll show these later. Not sure if you can see those. All those 64 games. I paid that and for a 64. I paid 10 bucks for everything. Freaking amazing deal. First ever garage sale fine for a 64. I gotta go back inside. I had a birthday party. I'll show you guys at the pickup what I got. I'm super stoked. First ever. And that's what I'm collecting for. So I'm stoked. Alright. See you guys in a bit. What's up guys? Pretty good deal to start the morning. Um, from uh, that sale right there. Show you what I got here. Ten bucks. I got that. Original Game Boy covers on it and everything. Uh, about six games. Tetris, Tetris 2, uh, Turtles, Millipede, Centipede, and uh, I can't remember the others. But ten bucks. Original in good, great condition too. So, hey, I like it. I like it. All right. I'll see you guys on my next find. Well, for Easter weekend, it's uh, going pretty good so far. From this cell right here, she's got uh, a little bit of stuff left, but um, I did find this. It's not gaming related, but this thing sells for like $30 plus for it. So it's a TI-84 plus silver edition. Works. So that's sweet. I got that for uh, two bucks. And, uh, yeah, she had Skylanders Giants, and she had gaming headsets that I seen on a tag, but, uh, they were gone. So, I was like, oh, well, <laughs> guess I'll just take this. But anyways, not game related, that still works, though, to help me game hunt, so, um, see you if I find something else. Alright, laters. What's up, guys? Uh, I picked up a few games here at this cell up here. Let's see if I can cruise by it. That cell right there. Hope you guys seen that. Um, for five bucks, picked up four games. A um, couple of them that I didn't have in my collection, so it's cool. Um, for the GameCube, Charlie Chocolate Factory, Backyard Baseball. Um, and that's another game that's hard to kind of find sometimes. Is Turtles 2 Battle Nexus. Um, and I'll say I had an Xbox game, Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic, that I swooped up. Um, so yeah, picked those up for five bucks, and uh, it's getting close to the end of the day, so I don't think I might not find out anything. I might hit up a pawn shop uh, here in a little bit, because they're getting ready to open, and probably call it a day and show you guys what I get at the end. Alright guys, see you in a minute. Hey, what's up guys? Um, I've just seen you seen some live, live footage here. Um, this is going to be like a two-part pickup video. Um, I already made my other video, um, so you'll see that next. But I forgot to add some things that I picked up at another garage sale. I happen to put, because they're like loose copies, and I didn't want them to get all over in my car seat or anything like that, so I put them in my middle console, and I completely forgot about them, so I want to put them in right now. I don't have footage from picking it up or anything like that, because I just didn't my phone or something for whatever reason I just took off put them in my console took off but picked up a, a Dreamcast bundle for five bucks I got all these discs for five bucks no jewel cases um, got a couple loose copies and a couple copies with the instruction manuals so I'm gonna kick it off real quick so we can get back to the or get to the next pick of video of my other scores today um, Ready to Rumble Boxing I got for Dreamcast. Keep in mind, all these discs are in great condition. Um, Razor Scooter. Razor Freestyle Scooter. Um, Championship Surfer. Rippin' Riders. Tokyo Extreme Racer. 
Dave Mira BMX. Cool, cool game to have. Wish I had the instructions to these. The ones I'm showing right now are just a disc. Oh, they don't have the instruction manuals. These are just part of the bundle. Tony Hawk Pro Skater, straight from Blockbuster. A game I'm excited to have. I just, but I wish I had to hold. The, I wish I had it complete, but at least I got this Sonic Adventure 2. And now these are the ones that came with the booklet. NFL 2K. As you can see. Crazy Taxi. Tomb Raider Last Revelation. Sega Smash Pack. I'll be able to find some jewel cases at least to put these in in the meantime until I find the rest. Chicken Run. Toy Commander. Sonic Adventure. This has like a torn piece. Um, it's still together. It's still together. It's just ripped. Um, Centipede came with no game, but I got the instruction manual. And another cool game I'm glad that I found is Super Magnetic Neo. So those are cool to have. I picked all those up for five bucks. I can pass it. I mean, I can find jewel cases. Eventually, maybe I can find the actual cases that they go in um, to make them complete. Um, so yeah, like, like I said, <laughs> I forgot all about these in my car. I'm gonna um, add this to this pickup video. So you're gonna see the pickups of everything you've seen before, the live footage next, right? What's up guys, Jason here. With the pickup video finally after what three four weeks I'm gonna show you everything up to today um, Saturday the day before Easter uh, I'm gonna go through this quick I got about 15 minutes left on my phone here um, that I'm recording off also I'm gonna start doing my pickups with a garage behind me don't have much room in my house plus it's pickups from garage selling so it kind of matches so hey it's all about what I pick up right it's not what's behind me right maybe in the future I don't know not gonna worry about it right now. Uh, first pickup, picked up for $1.50 about three, four weeks ago. I actually should have put it on my last video. I forgot about them. Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video of what I found with those white birds um, and what I found before. But I picked these up for $1.50 at a Goodwill weeks ago. These nice looking guides, black and white version. Goodwill, it was half off that day. Make sure to see that tag. It says $2.99. Also got Heart Gold and Soul Silver version. Very good condition. These are really good guides. Um, I used them when I was little. Um, also in a Goodwill I picked up for three bucks. I looked this movie up. Um, my credit. Um, okay, Chief finding a clock of this. And when I looked it up, like everyone's like, "Oh, that's valuable. Let's pick it up. Turn it around. Go back." And, I, and then this title on my eye I got I just picked it up um, out of I don't know by watching his video I was like I better pick this up his thing was valuable this should be valuable and sure enough when I've been looking at it I've been scanning the barcode I've been typing it in on Amazon eBay all other places and this is like a 60 to 80 dollar movie and that is um, Sailor Moon volume 14 the last one love conquers all I picked that baby up for $2.99. Great condition movie. Can't wait to watch it. Check it out. See what the hype is about. But that's cool to have something like that in the collection, if that's true. Um, another thing I picked up. I don't even remember when I picked this up. I paid $4.99 at Goodwill. But it's a Ninja Turtles for the GameCube. Um, I love Turtles. I was a Turtles kid when I was little, so I'm going to pick up everything Turtles. And it's in great condition. It's complete. Um, just got fingerprints, very light um, scratches on it, so can't wait to play that with my oldest son. Nice, play the turtle games too, so that's gonna be dope to play. Um, 
next when I went to Farmington, I didn't. I tried to vlog, but I didn't get very much footage and stuff, and I just said screw it. Apologize if you're looking forward to a vlog. I don't have one. I was too busy having fun with my family so, and friends. So. But I did stop at a Goodwill and I picked up a game that I've never seen before and it looked kind of cool. My son, I thought my son would like to play it. Um, it also has not for individual cell on the back of it. And it's um, for the Xbox, grabbed by the Ghoulies. And see, it has that not for individual cell. So I don't know if that means anything or anything. Um, I wasn't, I'm never owned an Xbox. <laughs> I've been 60 f Nintendo and Sony. I've never had an Xbox. My well, my oldest has a has a 360, so that's why I got it for him because it seemed like a kid's game. But it is complete and it is in superb condition. Um, hardly any scratches on it. Yeah, it's like brand new. Um, but if you have played it, let me know. Maybe I want to check it out. Um, let me know if you played it and see if it's cool or not. Um, that'd be cool. All right, so my next one is going to be, you've seen footage of this one of uh, me, so excited. I had to sneak out of a birthday party to tell you what I found, and that's the 64 um, score. We were early to the birthday party, and we just cruised around looking at garage sales. We went to like three of them total, um, just to waste time, because um, we were early. And we pulled up to one. I know the habit of getting out of everyone now because there's some that I, I walk up to and there's games sitting in boxes that I wouldn't have seen if I just drove and peeked up around the driveway of what they had. So I was gonna get out anyway, but my son, even before we parked, he noticed, um, I noticed DVD looking cases. So I was like, oh, DVDs or PlayStation 2 games or something, you know? But he right away, and he was right next to it, right away. There's a stack of 64 games. And I was like, oh, what? That's what my collection, that's what I want to collect for is the 64s. Well, for all my uh, sons growing up, all my, my younger ones growing up too, and me, and now I, um, I love the Nintendos. I mean, you can't scratch a disc. Little kids grab them all they want. I mean, you gotta do it's pretty heavy down with the damage on um, on like a disc. Um, so, there's another lady there. She, her son had an Xbox in his hands. He, Nope, we're getting this. And I was like, I don't care about that. <laughs> I'm caring about the 64s, but I was being nice. I was being nice because he had PlayStation 2 games, a 64 games, a 64, and a, um, the Xbox the kid was touching. And the lady, her, the lady was on the phone with her husband, it sounded like. And they were talking about the 64. And so I did my space, looked around the rest of the garage cell. So they decided on the Xbox boxes and um, took off and so that's why I said how much you want for these games and what I seen right away I was like oh my god I gotta pick these up these be a good price and I asked how much are they for the games 64 games and she's like I don't know my husband should be back in he's like oh actually he's right here he's walking up the driveway how much honey how much are those 64 games 50 cents a piece and I was like oh I'm getting every single one then <clears throat> and there was um 12 of them so I asked well Instead of 12, would you do, or instead of 6, would you do 5 for all of them then? <coughs> and I'll take them off your hands, and she's like, yeah, it'll work. And she's like, if you want, you can take the 64 too for 5 more bucks. It doesn't have any power cable or AV cable. And I said, yeah, that's fine. 64s go out. They don't make them anymore. Then I have backup. So, got the 64. It's pretty messy. It doesn't have the backs or anything like that. Um, <clears throat> has a jumper back in it. Um, games I picked up. Some of these I didn't have in my collection, like this one, Madden 2001. Blitz, I already have that one, 2000, Blitz 2000. These Rusties I didn't have. Toy Story 2, Pilot Wing 64. Killer Instinct Gold, Star Wars Rogue Squadron, a beat up copy of Star Fox 64, a good copy of Star Fox 64, uh, I already got this copy, Golden Eye 007, my copy's cleaner so I'll trade that one or sell it to somebody, Diddy Kong Racing, I think my copy might be cleaner than that one too. I don't have this, Banjo-Kazooie. <clears throat> and I have a copy of this, 
Zelda Ocarina of Time. And my coffee's cleaner, so I'll be trading or selling that one. Um, so that was that. Ten bucks for all that. Sweet deal. Super stoked. I was so stoked. I didn't buy the footage you've seen already. I had to step out and say, oh my god, guys. Because a lot of these games, like, like this one, more than pays for that lot. So, it's cool. <clears throat> Alright, today, excuse me. <coughs> Ooh. Okay, today. I'm just telling you that. I got Sunday, so I gotta make quick kind of. Alright, today, didn't expect very much, but I got some cool stuff considering it being um, uh, Easter weekend. Um, but I wanted to go out. I didn't go out last weekend. I missed a big one, so we were just way too busy. Well, I had two birthday parties, and. Hey, who else did I go? I went to two birthday parties and some else in between. All that. Oh, uh, a festival, a salsa festival. Um, but this I picked up today for 10 bucks. Original Game Boy. It works. Uh, my wife was playing a game on here today. It works. It's got the, the back case. Um, my son was playing it too. Came with turtles. Follow the clan. Or follow the foot clan. Um, in your face basketball. I don't even know how to get this one out. Well, it's centipede millipede and I can't get it out. Um, Tetris, the game my wife was playing today. Um, Galaga Galaxian. Galaga Galaxian. And I have Tetris 2 stuck in there. It has a um, speaker box, magnifier, and also this uh, rechargeable battery pack, which is pretty cool. Uh, what's even cooler, <laughs> when I dug into it after I got it, I was excited just for that, is I have all, all the instruction booklets to the Game Boy and the games. So, except for that Galaga one. Yeah. I have all the instructions booklets besides that one. So. <clears throat> and I'm guessing this might be a leak cable. Oh, that's one question. I'm gonna look real quick. I apologize. Yeah. Cool. So yeah, ten bucks for that. Awesome deal. I was, I was ready. I was, I was like, if I don't find nothing else, it's cool. I did go to another guard sale. And this is not game related, but these things sell for. More than 30 bucks pop, and that's a um, TI-84 plus silver edition calculator, graphing calculator. <clears throat> Just need new batteries, put pop them in, it works. So that was cool. Paid two bucks for that, and I paid four. I got four more games here to show you. Paid five bucks total for them for the Xbox, Star Wars, Knights of the Old Republic. For the GameCube, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. GameCube, Backyard Baseball. Charlie is complete. In good condition, these are too. Um, this even has an overseat. 16 bucks they paid. But complete. And another cool one I was glad to find. I might find number three maybe next week, the way I'm going. Turtles 2 Battle Nexus for the GameCube. And that 2 is also complete. And I'm stoked about this one because it has SNES Turtles in Time. You can lock and play in that. And I was so close today. Like literally 10 minutes this guy told me. I just sold my box of Genesis and SNES collection. And he's like, I kid you not, you're about 10 minutes too late. And I was like, oh my god, I didn't even ask him how much I was. I was just fuming that I missed that because I want to play Turtles in Time, but I gotta find the Super Nintendo first. And whichever comes first, I guess, the next thing I might have to purchase. But yeah, so that's all my collection that I picked up the last couple weeks. Um, sorry about the long wait. Holidays, me being busy going in and out of town. Um, <clears throat> next week, I hopefully should find a lot of stuff. April is super season for a garage sale here in Arizona, so after 
Um, last week was busy with community cells, and I was too busy to go to them. I was excited for this weekend, and then like Wednesday is when I found out. Um, is when I found out it's Easter weekend, so I was like, oh crap, there ain't gonna be crap. So I still had to go out because I was stoked and had to go out a little bit. But next weekend, I'm hoping to find my Super Nintendo because I want to play it so bad. Um, all I want really is I want. I want Super Nintendo games, I mean, I got that Tech Mobile already, as you've seen before, and the Turtles in Time, those were my two favorite. Number three would probably be Mario Kart. I don't think I really had anything else I really played. I know I played Mario Kart, like, every day in fourth to sixth grade of my friends before I went to school in the morning. King Mario Kart champion here, every time against them. But yeah, my time is running now pretty soon, so I appreciate you guys watching, I appreciate you guys' uh, um, patience. As I wanted to get a good collection of stuff to show you instead of a little bit by a little bit of time. And, um, yeah, that's some of these games, let me know. Um, like the, especially this one, this one looks cool and interesting. If you know anything about that Sailor's Moon, um, I guess that's almost Banjo Kazooie. I've never played, I'm gonna play it because I love 64. And, yeah. Yeah, I don't know what else to say, but I appreciate you guys watching, subscribing, commenting, um, share it. Um, things are heating up. And go Dolphins. No. <laughs> um, yeah, peace, guys. Appreciate you.